I am running iOS 17.4 RC update as you can see the build number and for now my battery stands at 20% so I am going to charge this one and we will see how the day goes so let's go. So I was using it for a while and right now as you can see the battery stands at 84%. Before digging into the battery performance, let's talk about what is new with the iOS 17.4 RC update. Okay, so talking about what is new with the iOS 17.4 RC update is definitely transcripts in podcast. Now you can view the transcript, you can view what you are listening to, you can also read and you can also scroll just like this one as you can see. This can be a very useful feature for those people who love to listen podcast. Along with the podcast features, there are also over new 30 emojis that are available with the iOS 17.4 RC update. Right now, as you can see, my phone battery is at 73% and now I'm going to play PUBG Mobile to see the performance and the battery life. So let's go and play PUBG Mobile. I will see you after this game. Okay, right now it's 7.53, so I played PUBG Mobile for 1 hour and 30 minutes and the battery is now 38%. So it dropped around 35% for using it for 1 hour 30, uh, 30 minutes on PUBG Mobile, which is not decent. And now let me tell you why it is not decent. Playing PUBG Mobile for 1 hour 37 minutes has consumed 35% of battery, which is really bad. Because on iOS 17.3.1, it was much better. If it was iOS 17.3.1, it will take around 20 to 25% battery. But on the 17.4 RC, it took more than 30. It took around 35%, which is not really good. Also, I felt that device gets a bit warm, which was never happened before any iOS version. But on the 17.4 RC, the device get a bit warm and these signs are not really good for the iOS 17.4. Now let's do a Geekbench test and compare it with iOS 17.3.1. Let's go. So this is the Geekbench score. It is 2314 on single core and 5603 on multi core. But if I show you and I compare you, it is quite little bit better than the average one and quite better than the average one on multi-core. But it is not good than the iOS 17.3.1. This score is of iOS 17.3.1 and this is for iOS 17.4 RC update. And you can see iOS 17.3.1 was slightly better. It was around 200 points more on multi-core and around 25 points on a single core. So yes, iOS 17.3.1 was slightly better in the Geekbench score. Now, if I talk about overall performance, there is nothing issue at all. Everything is working really fine. Everything is really smooth. I like the performance, but I'm a little bit disappointed with the battery life. Now, let's talk about battery life. So talking about the battery life, as you can see, I have used my phone more than 100%. It consumed 110% battery life and gave 8 hours at 55 minutes screen on time. Which is good, but it is not good. It is not better than the iOS 17.3.1. iOS 17.3.1 was slightly better, but there is a twist. iOS 17.3.1 was slightly better when it comes to PUBG Mobile. PUBG Mobile, I played for 1 hour and 37 minutes and it consumed 35% of battery, which is not really good. Before on iOS 17.3.1, it must be consuming 20, around 20%. So yeah, I am not satisfied with the battery performance of iOS 17.4 RC update. Now my final words. Yes, iOS 17.4 RC is out with so many features. There are many different features, new transcript feature in the podcast, new emojis. The iOS 17.4 came for the EU region that launches a very new uh, feature that was implemented by the EU region that was about alternative app stores. So there are alternative app stores, but for the people that who live in EU region, they can uh, install different applications from different app stores that is available for that region. 
Everything is fine with the R17.4 RC, but I'm a bit disappointed with the battery life. I was expecting to get a better battery life, but it is slightly a downgrade of battery life from uh, iOS 17.3.1. And I hope when iOS 17.4 actual public update comes, it gives a better battery life. Well, that's it from this video. I hope you like this video. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up. Do like and share this video, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in my next video. Do that. Take care. Peace out.